showing your beautiful drawings and especially your your journals and uh, and looks like you've also moved on to a different uh, line of print, uh, line of print, yes, kind of thing. Tell us a little bit more about what is the, what are the different things that you run and do, and where do you come from, right? And where do you run? Do you run classes? I do. Yes. yes. So I've come down from Auckland to Livermore Nui because it's, I love the art scene and the art community down here. Um, I um, I run workshops. I work in, as, as book illustrator um, and write, write and illustrate children's books, which a lot of this artwork has come from, has been done for. And um, I also do a lot of botanical work, botanical yes. illustration, um, like, like this, and um, printmaking. Um, and I run workshops on all those things. I run workshops on um, watercolour, uh, work with flowers and with autumn leaves and I run workshops on children's book illustration. Um, usually in summer now we're running a week long course on children's book illustration where I look at character development and then making a dummy, working with storyboarding and making a dummy book and then techniques. So that takes up the whole week in January. One of, um, we, we just started that this year and we're going to try and keep that as an annual event. Um, and that um, also I run workshops on nature journaling, which is a passion of mine. Um, I'm just taking yeah. that. So uh, nature journaling is recording um, the environment or the wildlife um, that you're in, and you can record it in so many different ways. That's just a tree. Um, and you can add words with what, it as well. What medium? So that's uh, pen and wash, pen and watercolour wash. That's pen and watercolour wash. That's of the giant rata at Bushy Park. Oh, and I run uh, workshops at Bushy Park in December, well, in January, sorry. It's one for children and one for adults. Um, now Bushy you know, Park. when I looked at like this, you wondered I thought what it was sand Oh, yes, yes, I can see that. Grass, yeah. I didn't realise it was a tree. Yes. And um, oh, then, okay. you know, I record birds. I love sketching birds. And previously, I've been spending a lot of time at Miranda Shaw Bird Centre. Um, and I run workshops there as well in nature journaling. And uh, that's just a neat uh, Oh, That was a, an amazing um, devil's hand tri um, tree that was growing in Auckland where I was living at the time. And I just recorded the flower, the different stages of the seed pod. And this is the pollen hand that comes out. Have it's you incredible. always been artistic from young? Um, since here, yeah, yes. quite young. Yes. I so, started so it's doing just, that. Oh, look at that. That was a design for a tea towel, so I do a lot of merchandise now. Oh, and the, the Godwell at that. And um, a version, not that particular one, Shakespeare's herbs, but I did the alpine plants. So Tongariro turned them into tea towels. And tea towels. Yeah, so a lot of merchandise as well now. So cards, tea towels, prints. Um, and wanting to get into scarves and um, yeah. tissue paper, a pattern wrap and paper yeah. and so on. But it's, I think as an artist, yeah. sometimes you have to move into merchandise yes, to get your work just actually out there. Yes. 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 Okay. Yeah, so um, I use a lot of techniques and I teach a lot of techniques. So, yeah. yeah. Well, um, we hope to be a student one. Thank you. I <laughs> it's always great fun. I love teaching and I love to meet you, teaching at the community level. Um, yeah, community especially education. That. And nature. You know, just taking a yes. book and just start Yeah, teaching. and yeah. I think it's important yeah. that people realise to do nature journaling, you don't have to be an amazing artist. It's all about your connection yes. to the, to to the moment, moment, to what you see, and getting it down visually yes. as well as with words. Oh. You know, it's, That's so encouraging. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to be a brilliant artist. Okay. Yeah. Okay, lovely. Um,